I grew up in an amusement park as a kid and loved every minute of it. And this is like going back in time for me. We, we could not run this event without student volunteers. That's just, that's a matter of fact. And every year we're like, are we gonna get any this year? And when we do, they turn out to be great. Yes, I've been coordinating volunteers since about six o'clock this morning. Uh, we arrived to an empty parking lot and by about 8.30 we had uh, tons of uh, activity and students that were here helping out. It really is exciting, especially this morning. It was only about 40 degrees and the students were all here. They were all cold. The sun's out now. Uh, all the inflatables are up. The students are engaged and uh, it's really, it really is exciting to see it. Um, and it's exciting to see that they're enjoying the activities. Uh, the business is Colorful Creations. I make handmade children's accessories, basically capes, masks, hair bows, headbands. Um, pretty much everything for the child in your life. We've actually, um, my husband actually went to Slippery Rock for a few years, years ago, um, and then we did it pre-pandemic, pandemic, um, and we loved it. We did it for about two or three years then, and then, you know, they took the year off. We weren't able to come last year, but we were able to, it kind of worked in our schedule this year, so we were back and we're excited to be here. My business started about a year ago. Um, I was just like very passionate about you know clothing and just very passionate about being creative so um, I just decided to um, take the next steps like start it and just see where things go you know so I just wanted to um, enjoy the time out here um, and also just get some exposure um, and just uh, spread the brand and you know um, yeah. I sell basically jewelry, uh, merch, like t-shirts, hoodies, um, and um, sweatshirts, and just basic merchandise, basically. So.